Welcome back, everybody, to Upper Mississippi River Valley, episode 11, here with Mr. Blue, Mr. Blue Farms, that is, a.k.a. Tommy Miller. How y'all doing today, folks? Y'all doing all right? We're in, we're going to get, what is it, Colas, 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 Lexon 795, the monster. Oh yeah, she started up, she's purring, she's ready to go. Alright, sorry about that folks, thought I had my phone on vibrate, but apparently I didn't. I'm getting tired of these scam calls, that was a Shelby from uh, some kind of credit agency, wanting to lower my credit debt. Well guess what folks, I don't have no credit, my credit was bad a long time ago. But uh, I'm just putting my phone, phone, bleh, my phone, my phone on vibrate. Anyway, back to the game, right? We're gonna make sure. Okay, it should still be laying down straw. We're gonna start this bad boy up. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. We're going. Let's get that off there. Oh, I know I'm half full. I know, folks, it's been so long. Ah, right, this thing flies. See how a worker. And it's going to go real slow. Oh, let's just see what it's going to do. Yeah, we're here in our 6R. It started picking up straw. Well, folks, seriously, though, how have y'all been doing? Y'all been doing all right? Ah, right, that's good. Oh, oh, that's not. Well, as far as me, I've been doing all right. I'm trying to get back in the groove with doing these videos. And this is like everything's piling up, piling up, and I got this to do, I got that to do. And, uh, but I, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I don't know how many I actually going to upload this week, but. But I'm going to try to get a full weekend. Now, I know we ain't supposed to talk about money and stuff, but my Google AdSense is on the 10th of each month. And I really slacked last month. Seriously. I, I went from a couple of dollars down to a dollar. I got this guy right here. I'm going to have to run all the way back down here and get to the other tractor. Now, in real life, if he's one person, that's what you would really have to do. You would actually have to walk back and get to the other track. Oh, I miss him. I miss him. I'm telling on myself. I'm going to tell on myself. I did not leave his tractor running, folks. But check that out, Mr. Blue Farms on the 8R. 8400, folks. We got the uh, 1050... Harvest Commander by Kintz, K-I-N-Z-E, which has been upgraded, you know, made it, you know, I think it's about 60,000 liters. But I just wish it was on tracks. I know they got one with the tracks, but I don't like the way it unloads. Uh-oh, look like I got a problem here. We have a problem. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna fix that problem. There we go, he can just follow. Let's catch his combine again, folks. Let's catch his combine. Oh, can we make this curve? 
Can we make his turn? Oh yeah, there we go. So be sure to leave down in the description, folks, if y'all want to. Uh, anything y'all would like to see, except for other games, I might do some Xbox games again. Uh, actually thought about picking up Minecraft for extra video. But, uh-oh, uh-oh. He is full. But, uh, we are harvesting, uh, I believe it's mullet, which is actually Milo. Let's just call it mullet up in Upper Mississippi River for some reason. I'm actually going to get this tractor to follow the combine instead of following the straw. Oh yeah, look at there. I love that monster it unloads so fast. And yes, folks, all my mods are pretty much upgraded by me. Most of them. And this map has been upgraded by me also. So uh, when y'all go download the original, let's check out this Milo so y'all can see what it looks like. It's pretty close to the real life, what it looks like. Is this kind of taller than that. Whoa. But, uh, yeah, I thought about doing uh, this my, my way of Minecraft, you know. I know it's old, but I, I love playing Minecraft. Uh, as you know, I love playing Farming Simulator. But folks, before I get too much further in, I, I should have done this at the beginning, but if y'all don't mind, within the next five seconds, I know y'all can do it, hit that subscribe button. Okay? Five, four, three, two, one. Oh, look at there, look at it. Oh, you didn't hit it. Yeah, you, you know who you are. Come on now, go down there to hit it. Hey, there you go. You don't have to click the bell unless you want to. If you like it, click the bell. You'll be, uh, you know, giving an alert when I upload, which hopefully is every day at 2 o'clock. All right, folks, we're going to let this uh, crew go ahead and take over. I wonder if I can do that, see how this works. He'll probably go and miss some, but uh, we'll, we'll see what it does. Let's just go over here. Uh, we got some trucks we need to haul. We got some combines we need to get going. Oh, and the sprayers. Mower. I'll tell you what, let's go ahead and get cutting here. I don't know if we can hire a worker. Oh, we're just going to see what he does going to do. God, that's loud in my head. I hope it ain't loud to y'all. But we got the S series. Just in case y'all didn't know, it's S690i. Which is a wonderful, wonderful combine, folks. Oh, oh, don't want to leave none. Whoa. I, d I just can't hardly do 3D, folks. I cannot do 3D at all. Or not, what, not 3D. Uh, what is it? First person? First person, yeah. Uh, what you what you gonna do, Mister? Who is on there anyway? 
I think we got J-Boo back on that. Oh, oh, oh. We get out of his way. He's going to back in that tree, I bet you. Yeah, he's going to back in that tree, so I'm just going to stop him real quick. We're going to go ahead and get him turned around. Uh, we gotta go all back up in there. All that over there, all that over there's gotta be cut. Ah, ah, get back in. There we go. Yeah, I should have let the uh. The uh, yeah, that tractor up there follow us. But it'll be okay. I'll probably go ahead and hire him, but I'm gonna drive around just a little bit, see what this field looks like. I know y'all probably want me to zoom in, but I'm gonna zoom out. I really don't know how we're going to get over there. I'm going to let the extension take over for a minute. And we're going to look and see what we got up here. At the very top. No, no, no. We are in the middle here. So actually, that field is not mullet, it's that. Okay. No, you don't, Mr. Mr. J. Bo, we're going to go this way. Question is, is this other combine going to do the same thing? Because I need to make a cut down in that way. Okay, he's going back up good. Alright. We're going to go through the saloon right here. Whoa. Deeper than I thought. Deeper than I thought. Oh, I won. I got to get the, uh, yeah, this guy. I need to make a cut down through there. We're going to go around real quick. Well, follow me. And, folks, this is a, uh, what was it, another AR? Yep, another AR with a Mr. Blue. Oh, is that in Fowler? Oh, excellent, excellent. That's just awesome right there. We're going to do him about 30 meters. I'm going to run up here and grab this front combine. Jay Boot can just hop in that back there. Yeah. So this ain't too bad right here. Now, we did have an update. I can't remember what version of the update it is, but it's like a 1.5.1 maybe. Don't hold me to those numbers. But uh, I'm pretty sure everybody's done seen it by now. Um, 
Which one's Kayla? That's Doris and that. So it's got to be the other. Do I have the... Oh, yep, yep. This one's full. I just got this sitting here. One thing about this guy's empty out pretty fast, but shift F to knock that and all. Well, I've been doing pretty good. I'm just going to go ahead and put him on the combine. And put the green buggy behind. Now I do not have a truck over here yet, so I'm going to be kind of slatching on that. And I really see our truck semis is shift, uh, it's a left shift and six. And we're loaded with corn, folks. Which that up there ain't. So I don't know how I'm going to do this. So we we'll go all the way down here. And I need one at the pig area. And I need one up by field 12. Alright, so I'm going to do it like a follow me or something. But we'll probably do that next episode. Because these guys need some help around this curve here. As long as the front one leads, it's not too bad. But, uh, I need to, like, that follow me trick I did on, uh, uh, corn belt. Alright, uh, I'm gonna let him go. Alright. Uh, that is doing pretty good. If I do say so myself, kind of curious how he does his turns. It's not going to lead too much. And this guy, got to see what he's going to do, which I'm controlling now. I think I can get all of this. I'm not for sure. Oh yeah. One stop left. I ain't going to worry about it. Not going to worry about it. Alright. I need to quit doing that and just raise the header up. That'd make it a little bit more realistic. Get this guy back around. Try to get a full header as we can. I think what I'm going to do is fix and cut them off. Let J Boo finish that fill. And, uh, I want to go over and get back in that fill. And Boo can run a runner up with the green buggy there yep that one's already doing its turn don't know what kind of turn he's doing but eh, eh, eh. yeah maybe 
back it back up. Yeah. But the uh, folks, uh, yeah. Uh, I just hope y'all enjoying this. You know, I want to. I started to say something like, "Oh, uh, I forgot," and I should have done it at the front of the video. But I want to give a shout out to Colin and Julian Vlogs. Y'all watching this, folks? Stop what you're doing right now. Go over and subscribe to his channel. He's an awesome YouTuber. He does daily vlogs, uh, skits, uh, fishing vlogs. You name it, he pretty much does it. Um, his latest video just done a thing on uh, I can't even think of the guy's name now. Logan Paul, I think. So uh, be sure and check that out. Uh, like I said, he's an awesome YouTuber. Uh, Mr. Yankee at Yankee Outdoors Adventures. Please go over and check him out also. Um, if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't know what I was doing on here. Between them two, they helped me out a lot. So, uh, go show us some love and support for me to them, if you don't mind. And uh, go check out their channel. At least, at least check out their channel. Uh-oh. Fuel tank going to be in the way. Hope not. Don't look like it. Let's right, see. Unload. All right. I'll turn this bad boy around. Come on, J Boo. You can do it. Yeah, I'm going back long enough for me to get this guy back. Didn't really need it, but just wanted ah, just want to do it just to be ready. Ah, I really, really didn't need the. Uh, the auger wagon, the gravity flow wagons could have done most of that. Well, so folks, uh, before we run out of time, as you can see up at the very top, I'm using the date mod, date and time mod. It's a new one. Uh, it's actually for January 8th, Monday, uh, 11.53 a.m. when I'm recording this. Uh, and y'all will probably see this on Wednesday if nothing goes wrong. Yeah, I know I'm almost full, but I think I can make it around. There we go. I'll raise the header up, keep the machine running with the header back down. I'm going to go ahead and let him do his thing and I think I'm just going to go ahead and stop the tractor and I wish we had the grain headers here that way we could cut those beans over there I'm going to walk over this to make sure that's beans. I know, I'm a speedy walker. Speedy, speedy, speedy walker. Oh, it's mullet. Milo. Okay, we're we going to have to get some. I'm thinking that is all the corn. Or is it? 24 is going to be. Uh, 24 is corn. 
growth on 24. Okay, all this up here has been harvest. We're harvesting the uh, mullet right here as we speak. Uh, that was corn. The uh, rest of this is mullet, I guess. Let's see. Tw we know 24 was corn. So that's the last of the corn there. So we'll take these two machines down to here and start harvesting this. And or some mullet as these three fields. So we'll harvest 24. Then we'll drop that corn headers. And then we'll go join uh, probably 8, 10, 11, and join 12. Uh, the monster combine in these fields here. Uh, 16, 15, 19, 20. Yeah, those are the ones we need to harvest. So, all right. So that's probably our game plan for next time. Let's check out. Uh, don't have no soybeans, but let's see what mullet is. Corn and mullet. What is a symbol for mullet anyway? Mullet is not very high, so River Valley. All right, uh, let's check on our animals while we're here, folks. No loan, that's good. Uh, look like our animals are going to need some food or pigs. And we're going to have them get them cleaned. Matter of fact, we got some corn. Uh-oh. Download this guy real quick. See, yeah, we got another field right there of mullet. So, yeah, we gotta get a truck over here. But, folks, I guess that's gonna. I hate to say it, but I guess it's gonna sum it up. But we'll, we'll hold on for just a little bit longer. And one more dump and I'll be full. Go ahead and get locked back on the hem. Uh oh. Come on, man. You can do it. I want to turn around and get this. If I have it on the right thing. Yeah, we'll go ahead and finish this up real quick. And then uh, next time I'll, I'll have the headers and stuff down here. Well, no, we got to go down. We got to transport. So I'll get them transported to the other field. And uh, we'll go from there. And I, I should have reset my hectares so I know how many acres that was here. Or hectares that was here. And, uh, yeah. But I do have a uh, feed. Uh oh, what are you doing? Well, I'll tell you what. You know what? If you're going to go that way, I'm going to go this way. I'm going to go ahead and go ahead and unload while I'm here. I'll let this guy finish that little bit and I'll get the other one unloaded and uh, put this in the trailer. This should hold the other field, maybe, hopefully. All right. All right, what are you doing? 
Uh, it's close to it. Ah! Try to back up over me. Uh, I think when we get everything harvested, that uh, we'll probably probably won't plant all the fields. We'll just plant the ones around the shop, maybe, and you know, maybe plant some straw around the pit, uh, around yeah, around the cows at least. All right. Load everything up. We'll go ahead and line everybody up in transport position. Usually let the combines lead since they're slower. Be a bad little spot for a little headquarters. Uh, let's go on run on down here a little bit. Because we need to go right over here. Oh, they're going to cook birds. Bushes. We're going to get in this tractor here. Is this Charlie? Whoa. I'm glad I left those sport, uh, spikes down. Uh, take the cover off. If I can put it on the right one. We are loaded with pig food, folks, so there we go. All right. Huh. Didn't need much. Thought that was like a storage deal, but I guess not. Okay. Um, put the cover back on. What's going on down here? What was this? Was this a... 8R or 7R? Ain't gonna be able to tell because the thing's in the way. Uh, nope, 7R. Okay. We're gonna park this bad boy under the shed back here. See, I don't think anything's planted here. We'll just go around this way. Ah, sorry, folks. I just heard the radio keyed up. I should have came on the other side. Back up here a little bit. I'm going to let our spikes down some more. Park this bad boy right here. And, uh, let's see what that put the, uh, pigs to. I can hear them in there. All right, yeah, good. All right, folks, we just need to get something up here to clean them. Uh, I think I do have a... Yeah, I have to swap it out, but I do have a uh, bucket right there. I probably need... I don't know where we actually clean them at. Is it right here? I don't see no other place. You know, that's when you get water there. Or that's where you do water. And I think this is the slurry. Oh, well, we'll have to do something next time, probably. Swap out the buckets and the grabbler or something. But well, we're kind of low on time today. Let's, let's go back to our combine. 
I was curious how much corn we had here. Thought he would be done by now, but I'm pretty sure he's not taking a full header. Look, like he's almost done. But anyway, I just, uh, sorry for the long episode. You know, it's kind of hard to get some stuff done if you don't do a little bit of overtime. So, on uh, the next episode of this, you know, like I said, we're going to finish up the corn. And then we're going to switch it over to the mullet heads, the grain heads. And uh, go from there. We're going to try to get all these crops cut before we do any planting. So it's going to be a lot of harvesting still to go. A lot of spraying. Uh, I don't know what map I'm going to use for tomorrow. So might be a little tree cutting on Oregon Springs still. Um, so don't hold me to it folks but I can guarantee uh, every day at 2 o'clock I should have a video out so I hope to see y'all there I'm going to have to cut y'all loose I'm almost at 40 minutes so uh, till next time folks I hope y'all have a great day a blessed day and I will see y'all tomorrow bye